uh, little Broncos news here. Uh, the Broncos are uh, clearing out space on the roster. Well, I mean, they, they did draft nine rookies. There. I know you're, yeah. you, but you teased this. And I thought, you signed nine free agents after the draft was over. You First you draft nine mm -hmm. guys, you draft then nine you sign guys. nine that's, free so agents. So that's 18. Yeah. They already have 80 guys who've been in the OTAs around that. Yes. you got to cut down to, what is it? 80. Yeah. So there are a lot of guys that have to be dismissed. Well, and two of them were today. Uh, a wide receiver named Jeremy Kelly and offensive lineman Paul Kornick, who we thought might might get a shot at well, uh, you thought it. getting into the rotation or at least you know ending up on the roster as, as maybe a right tackle. No, I didn't see that at all. Yeah. He wasn't. They put him in for two or three games last year when they removed Chris Clark, and he wasn't any good. And, and he was out there, and they re-signed him. I think it was a case that if they hadn't gotten somebody or in these OTAs that uh, uh, show, 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 Schofield, Schofield yeah. hadn't shown up as a somebody that they yeah. think is a prospect well, and two of their top four draft picks are offensive line yeah. so yeah. and one is uh, max garcia is very versatile yeah versatile he was a center at miami but he also played some guard and tackle and he can fit in he's kind of a younger version of manny ramirez would that be fair would you sure sure yeah like they, they, they traded manny ramirez who do you so. think is going to end up starting at right tackle chris clark I really, I, not just because he was here and we like him, yeah. and he's a good guy and intelligent guy. I think that it takes a year to get over an uh, Achilles heel injury. It takes a year to get over an ACL. It takes a year to get over the uh, whatever it is that Ryan Clady had that Liz Frank had. injury. Yeah, 